What if you have finally found favor? Huh? And then one sister did three days dry on your head. And I said, Chukwebka, oh, I die. Chukwebka, oh, I die. Now, let me tell you how God works. <laughs> God follows you the way you follow him all. You know, many people think that God follows everybody the same way. Is it true? God doesn't follow everybody. There is the hand that you bring is the hand that God will give out to you. I was discussing with, you know, Pastor Mecca yesterday. We were discussing. We spoke for long and we went to different place, different things. And then we came to a place we were discussing about prayer. Where the Bible said, when you pray, whatsoever you desire. Is it not true? Whatsoever is whatsoever. Including when the Bible said that there are some people that pray so that men can say that they are men of prayer. So that kind of person, what is his desire? So that people will say what? That they are men of prayer. And the Bible says, whatsoever is your desire, God will do it for you. So are you getting where we are going? So when that kind of person enters into prayer and he prays, God will answer his prayer. What is the answer to his prayer? That men will see him. So they will, they will not snap you when you are lying. And they will say, oh boy, that guy can pray. The guy don't pray, so tell you be prayer himself. Eh? And people will be talking about it. All you have gained after one year, two years, is that people, people speak about your prayer life that has not produced any result. And the reason is because the desire you had to enter into prayer is for people to say that. And God answered your prayer. Whatsoever you desire. <laughs> God will answer your desire. You don't know. Sometimes when we are praying. <laughs> what is somebody's desire is. Is. Is you. Mm. 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 <laughs> Make I want you, you don't know. I watched one small video clip, one joke, and one guy is on the mountain. How many of you have seen it? You have seen it. You are, I adjure you in the name of Jesus. If you have seen it, raise your hand. That one that said, Give me joy. Oh, I die. Give me joy. Oh, I die. Give me joy. Oh, I die. As we are doing, wow. Wow. Uh, I die. Oh, I die. <laughs> That's why you too, you need to be praying, you know. As I say, I, I die. Oh, uh, oh, I die. You too, we say, I counter it. In Jesus' name, I counter. In Jesus' name. Before a blue see. You will not hear me now. Until you will finish from prayer. And then you open your eyes. You look upon the damn and say, God has spoken. You will tell me that it was when I was praying and the Holy Ghost spoke to me. If you think I'm talking to you, I'm talking to you. Say after me, Hmm. You know when I say this thing, some of you will smile and laugh. This is reality. Whatsoever you desire, that means prayer predominance predominantly moves in the direction of your desire, especially your predominant desire. I remember those days in our church at home. We'll be saying, let's thank God. We'll be saying, Oh, Father, we worship you. There is one woman. She doesn't know what is Tango. As soon as she is saying Tango, she will be saying, Holy Ghost, fire, Holy Ghost, fire, I bind you. I say, this woman, we are thanking God. Thank God first that you are alive. <laughs> when you say thank God, her predominant desire is what? Holy Ghost, fire, die. Holy Ghost, fire, die. So for such a man, everything concerning prayer is die, die, fire. Including thanksgiving. The way to give God thanksgiving is what? Die by fire. You are now seeing how serious this matter is. You can take the Bible and say, He that findeth a wife findeth favor. Is enough. 
Are you getting the point? But you now said it takes favor to find a wife. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Hey. The otters in your village are there where? Hey. 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 What if you have finally found favor? Huh? And then one sister did three days dry on your head. And I say, Chukwebka, oh I die. Chukwebka, oh I die. Chukwebka, oh I die. You will come and tell me, Papa, I'm tired of school. God is telling me, I was, I saw Jesus come from heaven. This guy, if you want to, I saw Jesus come and he entered my room and he said, it's time to marry. That if I marry, things will normalize in my life. And what he didn't know is that, achanagenoko. <laughs> May they not cook you. If you think I'm, I'm, I don't know why I'm warning you, young men. If you like be doing man of God, it's men of God that are easy. The easiest people are men of God because your own is easy. Men of God is, if you are not a man of God, you can, you will know their skills. If they are moving, you'll be moving too. But man of God, your eye is blind. Apple later. You don't know that that apple have stayed in the in their prayer place for one week. They now give it to you. You eat it like Adam, and your eyes will open. If I ask sisters now, you find out they have done it, but you don't know. You have eaten many cake, many apple, many bread. It's only God in heaven that saved you. Otto <laughs> Woyeka. This guy has eaten one container. I'm telling you. That's why you too, you need to be cooking yourself. Cook yourself. Oh. I'm telling you, it happened to me many years ago. I was on fire. The anointing was too strong. I'm on a candle. When they are true, they, you don't know what I'm saying. Let me leave you. This thing now, some of you will say, uh, the will of God is the will of God. It can never change. You don't understand the realm of the spirit. Okay, let me leave that. Somebody is moving me to say more. Say more, say more. I will not say more. We are too like this one. We are too like her. Hey! We are too like her. Hey! Stop eating up. Stop eating apple. For you that found out is bread. What is the name of that bread? Love bites. Love bites. <laughs> they say it's love bite. There is love inside the, the bite of love. Wait. There is a bread called love bite. If they give you love bite, if you bite, it's the bite of love. <laughs> Amen. No? The same thing for ladies, for guys. There is a man that will use prayer and hold you down. After two years of marriage, you wonder why you married the man. I'm telling you, life. But you will know the manipulation in the beginning will be so much. 
And because you are just a church sister that doesn't have spiritual intelligence, you will not know the priesthood that is activated in the spirit to manipulate you. Huh? He will look at you and know you like Jim Jim, Jim Jim brothers. So he will position himself. He can, you are there, he will stay there. He knows you can see him from there. He will just take one of his leg and put it on the this. <laughs> When you see the person pray, say, "My God, will you ever give me a man like this?" I see that. When you when you now say it, the man is winning. Before they said, before the man said anything, you have already married. You have already had two children. It don't matter anymore. 